Okay, so listen. We're playing a new game today. It's called Potion Craft. I have never played it. However, if I get to make some potions, that sounds good to me. So, let's explore it together. Let's start a new game. <clears throat> okay, the story begins. You're a novice alchemist wandering the world in search of your destiny. After a long journey, you have finally found a place to ply your trade. Hmm. Abandoned house. You found an old abandoned house on the edge of town. Judging by the alchemy equipment and garden, the former owner seems to have practiced alchemy. Apparently, a wizard used to live here. But the layer of dust and condition of the house suggests that it has been empty for a long time. So I'm just rolling up and plopping myself in this house? Is that allowed? <laughs> shop opening. You decide to turn the house into a potion shop. After several days of cleaning and preparing, your shop is ready for its first customers. It's time to remember your alchemy skills and start this new life in a new town. I gotta be honest, don't have any alchemy skills. Adding ingredients to the cauldron. Potions are made from ingredients. Take two terrarias and two water blooms from your inventory and throw them in the cauldron. To move ingredients, click and hold the mouse, drag them to the cauldron, and let go. Pay attention to the alchemy map in the laboratory wall. It shows you the path the ingredients create once they're added to the cauldron. Huh, okay. Okay, one. Two, one, two. Very good. After adding ingredients, you can stir the potion. Stirring the potion advances the potion icon down the path defined by the ingredients. Use the spoon to stir. Click and hold the mouse to move the spoon back and forth. Stirring allows the potion icon to collect experience points. Accumulating experience lets you level up, but has no effect on the current potion. Okay. Okay, so the books are experience points. Heating, now the potion icon is touching an unknown effect. To find out what the effect does, you need to add it to the current potion. To add the effect to the potion, you need to bring the water in the cauldron to a boil. Use the bellows to blow on the coals and heat the cauldron to the desired temperature. Okay, like this, like this, like this. Ooh, that was a really cool animation. I really like that. You know what, let me just pause and say that I really love the art style of this game so far. It's really, really warm. It feels very cozy. I think I'm really gonna like this game. <laughs> Finishing a potion, perfect. You've added a new effect to the potion. Healing, to finish making the potion, press finish potion. Down here, very good. Weak potion of healing. Cool, what does this do? Oh, it shows me on the map just zooms in. Love it. Um, grinding ingredients. A mortar and pestle and are, al are an alchemist's best friends. You can use the mortar and pestle to grind up practically any ingredients and unlock their potential. This helps you create the same potion using fewer ingredients. Try to create the same potion using just one terrarium and one water bloom. Okay, a place here. And I go bop, 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 bop. Until the X marks the spot. Okay, now add it to the cauldron. Bloop. A bloop. Completely grind the water bloom using the, yeah. Okay, so now we want this as well. Oh. <laughs> the way it just on the floor and I can pick it all up at once. Can I draw can I manage to drop it all in there? No. Okay, there we go. Okay, sorry, I'll stop. Mucking about. Mark, mark, mark. Bloop, bloop. What if I mush it too much? Is there a too much? Maybe not in the tutorial. Let's just toss that off to the fucking side. Just toss it across the room. Can we toss it across the room? I can! <laughs> oh, sorry. Stirring. Oh, I got one talent point. I got more. Heat the potion. Yes. Love that little animation. I'm dying for it. 
Saving a potion recipe. Excellent. You made the very same potion, but used half as many ingredients. Efficiency. Your first potion attempt won't always be the most optimal, so experiment and perfect it. If you're happy with the potion you made, save it in the recipe book. Then you can make that potion in the future with the click of a button. But I like doing the mush. Okay, save recipe. Finish. Moving between rooms. Okay. Offering potions for sale. Everyday people from all over town and even from other towns will stop by to buy various magic potions. Your job is to brew potions in the laboratory and sell them to customers. Many potions must be brewed for a specific purpose, but it's still a good idea to keep a few of the most popular potions on hand just in case. If a customer likes a potion, it will be clear from their reaction. A dagger, um, bad, a stabby stab, a heart, um, love, a very good. Offer a potion for sale. Okay. My husband has been ill for some time now, but recently got even worse. Now he can't even get up. He has a fever and sweats. Do you have any Do you have any medication for my poor husband? No, let him die. Fine. I guess you can have this one. <sighs> Sell. Okay, I was just walking down the street minding my own business when a flower pot fell out of nowhere and bonked me right on the head. It was the darndish thing. Good thing I've always had a thick skull, or I'd be out cold. Good one, buddy. But I've got a nice bump on my head now. What can I rub on it to make it go away? Um, I guess this one. To make more money on a potion, you can try haggling. Successfully haggling could significantly increase the price of a potion, but unsuccessfully haggling could do the opposite. Make it drop. Okay. Uh, I have to pick a topic of conversation. Food? Am I supposed to pick a subject that I like? That I... Sure. Okay. Let's do vegetables. Carrot. Carrot again. Carrot again. Carrot. 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 Oh my gosh, it's getting smaller. Carrot. 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 What? Now it's gone? What am I supposed to pick now? Okay, I'll pick fruit. This fruit. Yum delicious fruit. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Mm. Sure. I didn't get anything. You already haggled. I haggled and didn't get anything. So. This is ridiculous. I'm a terrible haggler. Lack of suitable potions. You will often not have a ready-made potion for certain customers. That's okay. You can always go back to the laboratory and make the potion they need. There's no time limit. Oh god, I love that. The, po the client will not leave. Thank God. <laughs> I'm so glad it's not a timed thing. Enchanted garden. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's beautiful. The enchanted garden is one of the alchemist's main sources for ingredients. Everyday new herbs and mushrooms will grow in the garden. Oh, I can't wait to see what the mushrooms look like in this garden. Don't forget to pick them from time to time. Click on ingredients to gather them. Collect one terraria and one fire bell. Okay. Terraria. Fire bell. Nothing else. Okay, making a potion. The customer... A poison. Oh boy. Okay, I didn't even read what she said. The customer needs poison, which means you need to create a potion with the poison effect. You will have to look for most of the effects on your own throughout the map, but you remember from your alchemy lessons. Okay, apparently I had alchemy lessons. So that's great to know in what life that such a potion can be made from one terraria and one fire bell. A potion of poisoning. Try making a potion yourself. Don't forget to use all the alchemy equipment available. Okay. 
Should I mush? I will mush. Yeet. Good. Why did I put it in there? I should put it in here, right? Bum, 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 bum. Beep. Bloop. Oh, hold on. Oh, 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 I meant to stir it first. And now we light it on fire. Finish making the potion. Oh, weak potion of poisoning. Save the recipe, yeah. Return to the shop and sell the potion. Okay, hello, mice have infested my hut. Even though I have a cat, the cat just lies in the cabinets and watches the mice do whatever they please. So I need a, viral, a vial of rat poison. It'll be easier to poison those rodents than wait for the stupid cat's help. Lady, what's wrong with your cat? Don't poison your cat, all right? I'm gonna try to haggle again because I don't really understand this. Weather. Yeah, sure. Oh, am I supposed to just click as many as... Oh. Okay. So you're not supposed to remain consistent. Very good. Once the last customer leaves the shop, you can go rest in your bedroom. It's located above the laboratory. Go to the bedroom and end the day early. Oh. I have a little calendar. I have a skull. Some dried herbs. Oh. I am living my dream as a witch. To end the day, click on the bed and confirm. Are you sure you want to go to bed? Yes. Oh. This is so lovely. I'm. This is an amazing game. Okay. Very good. This is your potion shop now, and you decide what to do next. Greet customers, chat, sell potions, haggle, and don't forget to gather ingredients from the Enchanted Garden. And gradually explore the alchemy map. Good luck. Thank you, you are leaving me alone. Grab an item from your inventory, grind up an ingredient to reveal its potential, toss the ingredient in the cauldron. Well, I haven't seen this one yet. Let's grind this one up. Chew in there? Did I just put this one in? Very nice. Whoa, what's this? What is this? Oh. Okay. Hmm. Let me try that one again. What is this one called? Wind bloom. I'm gonna put some more wind bloom in here and I'm gonna stir it up. I'm not gonna add any water to it. Um, okay, this one will take me that way, this one will take me this way. Let's see what just this one does. Anything? Nothing. Nothing, just keep stirring it. That'll take me back, this'll take me here. Adding one more looks like it'll take me somewhere interesting. Let's do that. Let's see what two wind bloom gets me. Oh. What are these? Is that dead? Okay. One. One doesn't get me anything. That looks like it takes me to death. That looks like it takes me to nowhere. This looks like it takes me back. What are these? Oh, I can sort it. Okay, cool. Let me. Ooh! Okay, thorn stick. I have wind bloom. I have that. What are these stink mushrooms? Yeah, let's take them. Sulfur shelf. Dryad saddle. According to the legend, the dryads of the forest rode these mushrooms as mounts. That can't be right. <laughs> this is so cute. What are these hiding back there? Goblin shroom. Contrary to popular belief, goblins do not cook with these mushrooms. Okay, let's go back. Let's see what we can do. 
What are the skulls? The skulls are spooky. Okay, let me bring it back a little. Yeah, let's put some mushrooms in there. Those in there. Give her a stir. Collect some points. Ooh, what's that do? That's neat. I'm gonna add this, a little bit more of this, and see if we can't get up there. Can I just stay right here? Yeah, perfect. One talent potion. Collect medium experience book them. Okay. Eat the cauldron when the potion is touching an effect on the map. Craft a potion. Okay, these are, this is chapter one. Very good. Sell a potion to a customer. Buy something from a merchant. Learn a new talent. Go to the basement. There's a basement? Ooh. Okay. Eat the cauldron when the potion is touching an effect on the map. I don't really remember what the effects look like. I know that these were... So maybe these little lines here direct me in the way of a an effect? This one just whooshed me away. Effect to complete the potion. Okay, well I've used literally a ton of wind bloom. Oh, this is cool. A little compass of different kinds of huh. Okay, I think I want to go up again. Let's see. Motion failed. Okay, so if I go on these little guys here, motion will fail. Put this one. keep going this way. Ooh. Ooh. Let's heat it. What was that? Frost. I unlocked a new effect. Heat the cauldron when the potion is... Okay. That's what I, what I did. Let's save that one. Is that how many different kinds we can make? I can make poopy. I can make relationship. Heterosexual relationship. Where's the gay? Where's the gay representation? Hello? I can make psychedelic. This is pretty cool. This is pretty, this is pretty cool. Finish the potion. Okay, let's go to the shop and see what's up. I don't know why, but food seems to spoil incredibly fast in my house. Do you have a potion that'll keep, that helps food stay fresh longer? Frost? Let's haggle, but maybe, maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Listen, I've been playing dredge lately, so, Get in these guys. Should be a piece of cake, but it's proving to not be. Okay. Oh, for 17. Yeah, that's all right. I need poison for a job. Can you make me some? For what job? You look sketchy as fuck, dude. You look sketchy as fuck, dude. Okay, can I just yeet myself that way then? Mush, 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 mush. There. We will mush to there. And then we will stir. Yes. Nailed it. Freaking nailed it. Save recipe. Wrong Finish potion. Alright. I 
have the potion for you, sir. It's cactus mush. All right, yeah, let's haggle again. Why not? Let's try this one. Ooh, 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 yes. Nice. Shell it indeed. I've got 169 gold. 69. 69. I accidentally jammed my finger and it still hurts. Maybe you can help. Uh, maybe. Is this the one? Is this... Okay, where do I see my recipes? Healing. Yes. Healing. This way. It's you, isn't it? Is this the same potion we made in the tutorial? Stir and heat. Finish. Very good. I have brought you your magic elixir, sir. And I will haggle with you because I'm not a little bitch. Give me your money. Uh, thank you very much. What do you need? Hi, are you the new alchemist? I am. I'm the local herbalist. I gather plants and sell them. Want to see what I have for sale? I think I have something that might interest you. If it's flowers, then yes, I'm buying. If you're trying to show me your goods... Are you coming on to me, ma'am? Anyway, I have all of these things except for this one. In my garden. Okay. I'll take... Take four of those. I don't know. Why not? Yes. I'm not going to haggle with you. You seem like a nice lady and I would like to support my local herbalist who wants to show me her goods. Do you sell anything besides herbs? I only sell what I know about herbs. Flowers, roots, and various berries and fruit. You can buy other things from other merchants. Cool. There will be other merchants, not just you. I like the lavender in her hair. It's lovely. I need potion to poison rats and other little vermin. I can do that one. I know about I know about that potion. It's it's called mushy cactus. Hot mushy cactus potion. Okay, we stir. Yes. And we light it on fire. Finish. Go. For you, ma'am. I'm haggling with you. I'm sorry. I need some money. Good. Good. Solid. Nice. Rocking it. One more. Oh, shit. <gasps> Do I have to get all of them? Okay. That's, that's fine. That's fine. Sell for $14. I need a potion that will help me keep meat and vegetables and other food fresh and preserved. Okay. You need my... My freezing potion. My keep everything freezing cold potion. I call it... Frosty Mush. Or a mushy frost. I'll, I'll put another one in there. Squish, 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 squish. Very nice. Okay, let's get on over there. I don't know about the heating of the frosty potion, but I won't question it. Let's haggle with you as well. Topic emotions. Okay. Let's see what we can get oh maximum lovely i need a potion that can get rid of cockroaches bed bugs and other insects you dirty bastard i don't know if i have that maybe poison do you think poison do you guys think poison i think maybe poison Yeah, we'll go with we'll go with poison, but we'll do it we'll do it a different way. Not just the mushy cactus. We'll do What was this called again? Fire bell. And we'll go down like this. Oh. 
Just chucking shit around. Just making a mess of the place. Alright. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. Finish potion. This will probably help you, sir. Yeah, let's try this one again. Weather. Nice. Nailed it. Got all four. <gasps> Shit. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Nice. Five? My bad. My bad. My bad. Anything else growing in here? Let's see what the basement is. Alchemy machine. This alchemy machine is badly damaged. Find a merchant who will sell you the parts for a new alchemy machine. Is that all? Is that all? Oh, what's this? Negrito. Oh, the alchemy machine. To restore it, create citronitis. Rubido. Oh, if I put a whole bunch of stuff in here, if I put a whole bunch of potions in here, I get gems? That's so cool. Okay. Um, look, there's little mushrooms growing down here and everything. It's really good. That's really cool. Okay, there's nothing I can do here. These are the legendary recipes. Shop upgrades. What's this? Okay. Things that I can upgrade. Used for stirring. <laughs> Anything else in here? I don't think so. Can I just experiment around then? Is it just my time to shine then? There's another swirly guy down here. Let's maybe let's go see about that. Oh, life leaf. That's the one that I bought. Let's put can I mush two? I don't think so. I, I think I can only do one at a time. Let's put two in here. Bring me all the way down. Oh, I can go even more down with another one. Let's see what that does. Okay, what do we get? Strength. Huh. Okay. Save recipe, finish potion. Interesting. This is really cool. Okay, what does learn a new talent mean? Is that like I need. You gain experience for creating potions, exploring the alchemy map, and collecting books on it. Completing goals in the alchemist path, gathering ingredients, yada yada yada. You get one talent point per level. Press the button to open talents. Talent point per level. How many do I have? Six? Yeah, let's get that one, and this one, and this one. Oh, can I get more? And this one, and this one, and also this one. Okay, let's... <laughs> I got really excited. I think... Okay, it tells me a summary of the bottom. So prices become 20% more profitable. Increase the chance of a bonus spawning 15%. Uh, increase the radius by 20%. Okay. Very good. I got too excited about it, so... I just upgraded everything. And we have a reputation as well. What is this? Root potion bases can be... Purchased from merchants. Okay. Is there anything else that I can click here? Oh, I can name the potions? Bitch juice. Um, bitch. Be gone. Frozen. Frosty toes. Magic better. What's that do? Continue brewing from here. <gasps> can I? <gasps> oh, that's cool. Hold on. Which way can this take me anyway? 
Let's go this way. It gives me a little diagonal. Okay. Okay, okie dokie. Can I go more? I can go right a little bit this way. get down there another life leaf okay get in there and we'll fire it up wild growth you unlocked a new effect Interesting. So now it's got a couple different effects. Hmm. That's pretty neat. Magic, better, growth. Yep. Yeah. Finish potion. Cool. Goal achieved. Create a potion with two different effects. Wow. I'm an overachiever. I think that one wasn't even in the first one. It, it isn't even in the second one. It's in the third chapter. I am a certified genius. Anyway, uh, go to bedroom, create a potion of fire. Where's fire? Probably this way. It's probably where all the basic bitches go. They go up, they go left, they go right, and they go down. Can this one bring me? Yeah, okay, it's probably with these guys. We'll just do some basic, some basic potion brewing, you know, no big deal or whatever. Like, I'm just brewing some potions over here. This is basic shit. Just the day in the life of an alchemist. Don't even worry about it. Okay, one more should get me there. That, that was a whole flower that went in there. It's all good. Wait. Can I... It had a two on it. It did have a two on it. Me, 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 Sorry. Sorry. Okay, let's heat this bad boy up. Potion of fire. Very good. Um, burnt toast. So you can have up to five effects on a potion, it looks like. We'll save the recipe and we'll go back. Oh, duh. Ooh. Okay, which one should we get? Actually, maybe we should. You can haggle on a hard difficulty. I don't know. I don't know about that right now. Increase radius. Bonus spawning. Prices become 30% more profitable. Let's go with that one because I want to upgrade the alchemy machine and I don't know how much that's going to cost me. Okay, let's. Go to bed and we'll finish chapter one. We should finish chapter one. The Alchemist Path, chapter one completed. Good job, you completed the chapter with each new chapter, new visitors, order types, potion bases, merchants, and purchasable items appear. Continue to complete the goals in the Alchemist Path to unlock the full potential of your alchemy equipment and learn all the secrets of the trade. Ooh. Okay. Chapter one complete. We have moved to chapter two, which is lovely. Is this all, or they slowly unlock? Create a potion with effect of tier two or higher. Brew a potion from the recipe book. Reach a popularity level of four. Create a potion of explosion, dexterity, and swiftness. Okay, so we've got our work cut out for us for the next episode. This was awesome. I'm really excited about this. Learning this has been a thrill, and I can't wait to do more witchy stuff in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to click that like button and subscribe to follow along with our potion creation. See you in the next one.